Welcome to Guns and Gear Network. I appreciate you tuning in. Today we're going to discuss cheap gun cleaning rugs from Lowe's. Stay tuned. Welcome back guys, appreciate you tuning in. So today we're going to discuss a budget friendly option for gun rugs, gun mats, whatever you want to call them, uh, for cleaning and maintenance of your firearms. And so before we get into the video, let me first say this. Um, we are under attack as far as the Second Amendment, freedom of speech, things like that. And I know it's almost cliche at times. It's been talked about for years now, but I think this one's pretty serious. Uh, I don't typically get too wrapped around the axle about some of that talk, but this time it's got me a little nervous. And part of that is that freedom of speech por portion of it that then I think doesn't allow us to have a voice to reasonably uh, dis have a discussion with responsible gun owners or responsible first-time gun owners or people that may not understand the Second Amendment and all that. So part of that is these videos, other gun channels, other Second Amendment sites. And so what we need you to do, and I'm asking this on all my videos now going forward, is to share content because we're being shadow banned, we are being demonetized, a lot of different things. They're playing with the system. Uh, with algorithms, what have you, so it's very difficult now going forward probably. It's going to get worse, but one thing they can't do is, is, is cut when you share videos, so that gets out to a broader audience. Uh, there's the share button, hit it, and it's got some links. You can then copy and paste links into maybe your favorite gun forum if it's not listed like Twitter or uh, TikTok or uh, Facebook or something, you know, if you've got a favorite gun forum. Start sharing the content over there. Uh, maybe even talk to one of your administrators uh, at the gun forum and ask, hey, can we start a YouTube uh, section in the forum to be able to uh, put videos in specific so you're not cluttering the page up. A lot, of, a lot of administrators don't like when you clutter the pages up with stuff. So anyway, share our content. That's very important going forward. Also, like our content. That helps with the algorithms and how they rank, rank us and rate us and uh, that sort of thing within the search engines. And then also um, make sure if you would like to subscribe to our channel, hit the subscribe button. And then uh, make sure you're adjusting your uh, notifications. So you hit the bell, and then it'll. A lot of times, I'll subscribe to people and forget to hit uh, all, and I'm not getting their videos, and I'm wondering why. And I realize I have to go back and reset that. So if you hit all, you'll get every one. You'll get a notification every time we uh, send out a video. All right, I'll get off my soapbox. Sorry about that. Just wanted to get that out of the way first. So anyway, it's cheap gun uh, rug and mat options. So you're probably used to seeing a traditional gun rug or mat similar to this one. This one is by thetacmat.com. Excellent product, and it was sponsored uh, by for a video by clubtac.com, which is one of the subscription boxes. So I've enjoyed this. I've got a couple of them now. I like them, and this is something that um, I definitely would recommend. However, uh, in my situation, my son, he is starting getting ready to start a hunter safety class, and then he's also starting to clean his own BB guns and rifles and things like that. So I wanted to put together a kit for him. And sometimes that can be pretty expensive when you're trying to put together a gun cleaning kit uh, for yourself or especially a loved one or your wife or, you know, your whoever you may be a significant other that you're trying to get some things together for them to have can get expensive, especially when you start talking, you might spend 20 to $40 just on the mat itself uh, before you even get going with the, all the other products. So I got to looking around on Amazon trying to find him some products and I stumbled uh, across a company that uh, I got to looking at their gun mats and I said, that looks a lot like indoor outdoor style carpet I've seen at Lowe's. So get to researching a little bit and I said, eh, I don't know. So I had to go to town today and uh, me and the family. So I swung by Lowe's and sure enough, I found something I think would work. So this is 27 inches by 5 feet. It is $12.88 from Lowe's. Comes in a roll just like you see here. I've already cut this and I've already unfortunately cut the packaging, but I did tape it back. Uh, this is made in the USA actually, which is a plus, and it's made by a company called Tenex, T-E-N-E-X Corporation. But that's what the packaging looks like, 27 inches by 60 inches in length. I've already cut two of them, one for pistol, you know, size, so I can just, you know, use this if I'm just working on a simple pistol, uh, cleaning it or something, and then I cut one for rifles and shotgun. You can cut any size you want. These are basically 12 inches in length, 
or width, I'm sorry, like this. And there, this one, the bottom one is 36, and this one was what was left on the run um, of the five feet. So I think this one's about 21, 22 inches in uh, length here. I may cut this down to about 18. It's a little bigger than I really need. I may even cut down this one. It's 30, you know, 36 inches. I just kind of went to yardstick length. And I kind of based it a little bit on this size, so I made it a little bit bigger than this one. So... Uh, this one's, uh, you know, just a little, this, I think this one's 10 inches wide, but instead of doing a bunch of cutting, that's the way I did it. So another thing that's kind of cool about this product is on the back, if you are uh, worried about chemical spills, things like that, this right here should stop it. And uh, it's got uh, the other mat that I saw on Amazon, it had something similar to this. And that's why I ain't so sure they're not getting this stuff from the same company and just calling it a gun rug. But um, these, um, is kind of a rubbery, plasticky kind of, should be waterproof and chemical uh, resistant. Now, when I say that, one of the things, one of the complaints I saw on the other, on that, uh, on a few of the reviews was the chemicals ate through this. Now, any chemical is strong enough is gonna eat through anything. So I would suggest if you have a major spill on something like this is I would, you know, hose it down with some soap and water and get it real good and clean and then air dry it out. Shouldn't take long to air dry something like this a uh, few hours and it should be good to go again. But uh, if you have a major chemical spill uh, on it somehow, um, then that's what I would do is, is probably rinse it all out. But uh, yeah, it's a little bit rough, so be careful sliding your firearm across it. It could cause some damage, maybe. They had another option that was, and I started to buy it, that was a little softer than this. And I waited around back there forever trying to get somebody to come back. And this that came on a big roll, and you had to cut it to length, whatever size you wanted. But I saw this while I was sitting there waiting on the sales associate and um, decided to get this instead. I think this will work fine. Um, pretty careful with my farms anyway, so you might want to even lay down like a little towel or something uh, with this. Uh, but this right here will keep from, like I said, chemical spills, overall general scratches, uh, because it's not like laying it on a bare table or something like that. These will work great. I know a lot of times when I go to the gun range, you'll want to do a little bit of maintenance, maybe a little bit of cleaning, maybe you got to need a repair. And a lot of times I'm scrambling trying to find something, maybe a piece of cardboard or something to lay my gun on to do that so it doesn't get all messed up. But anyway, guys, go to Lowe's, get you a big roll of this. I actually got plenty left over. Uh, so this is uh, like five feet of length left over plus whatever width this is. So, so this is five foot by 12 inches if you cut this portion off. I don't know why this is a little different pattern. So if you went down and cut this along here and so you'd have this, I could probably make at least two more of these right here. So for $12.80, I can have two of these. Cause I just now noticed that that is 12 inches perfect. And then I didn't cut any off the length. So I can make two more of these exact is what I can do by trimming this little piece off here. I don't know if you can see that in the camera, but you can see this is a different pattern. So I could literally cut along where the ridges are, cut that piece off and then have two more of these rugs just like this. And so I'd have four gun mats for $12.88. But anyway, guys, hope that was helpful. If you got any questions, post those below. If you've got any suggestions, maybe something you come up with uh, that's a good budget option, be sure to share that with us. And as always, guys, like, share, and subscribe. Bring another video shortly. Have a great day.